We sell quality weapons and we know how to use them. Have a good day, sir. Hello? Hello. Uh, is Mikhail home? No, he's out. Okay. Uh, should I wait outside? No, no, come in. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. Sit down. Thank you. You want some tea? Sure. Mikhail doesn't let me use this anymore. Says it makes us look like barbarians. Uncivilized. Like immigrants. Oh, yeah? I know what you're thinking. It is a bit funny coming from him. <laughs> he did not used to be like this. When we were young, at home, he was beautiful. He was happy. He made me happy. But um, then something changed years ago. I never quite knew what it was. So many years I wondered what it was or what was wrong with me that I did not see it in him. Or I changed him. Life is complicated. I, I never thought I'd live like this. No? When the war came, I did bad things. And after the war, I thought nothing of doing bad things. I killed people, smuggled people, sold people. And you don't worry about your soul? After you walk into a village and you see 50 children, all sitting neatly in a row against the church wall, each with their throats cut and their hands chopped off, you realize that the creature that could do this doesn't have a soul. God is very complicated. You mustn't give up hope. Huh. Well, I don't know about that. Привет, Лена. Привет, Ма. What is that? Uh... I tell you one thing and you ignore me! Oh. You stupid oh. bitch! Oh. <laughs> Nicobelic baby. Good to see you. Hey, you too. <sighs> what did you want? Oh, I want you to teach people 
to listen to me. You want him to get us the money. Fuck the money. Mikhail, please calm down. We're already in a lot of trouble. I don't know if I can smooth things over with Petrovic. Fuck him and fuck you. Who are you, my daddy? Get the fuck out of my house. Mikhail! Get out! So, what do you want? This prig who owes me money owns a garage in Chase Point. I want you to pick up a truck and take it to him. Call me when you get to the truck. It's in Shotlar on Montauk Avenue. Go. Get out of here. My car! Mr. Faustin, I have the truck. Drive it over to the garage on the corner of Guantanamo and Windmill. Park up inside. Sure. What am I delivering? When it's inside, trigger the explosive. It should blow up good. Maybe you'll be careful on the drive over. It's pretty volatile stuff. Explosive? What the fuck? Calculating route. Turn right. <laughs>
god, Roman, we should go and get drunk together. Roman, I'm nervous enough about driving a truck full of explosives around the city for Mikhail Faustin. He's out of control. Anyway, I'm sorry, but if I get drunk with you and then drive this thing, I'll definitely blow myself up. I'll catch you later, cousin. Under the car now. I blown the place up, but don't pull that shit on me again. Maybe I don't want to drive around while sitting on an atom bomb. I thought you were the ice cold killer. I thought nothing scares you, man. Pussy. Hasn't anyone got any balls? You and Dimitri, you'd be nothing without me. Nothing. This is how you treat me.
Dimitri. Hey. Sit down. What's the problem? What do you think? Mikael, Mr. Fausto. Uh huh. You're given a choice. Kill your best friend or die. What do you do? And there is no way out? Not now. Not after you killed Petrovic's son. You don't have any family. You could run. Wherever you go, people will find you if they want to badly enough. And for this, they want blood. But you and Mikhail, you have so much history. Sure. Well, I killed the boy. So they want me to? No. I told them you were a hired gun. And they said, as long as you were the one to kill him, you'd be spared. <laughs> so that's the way it is? Yes, that's the way it is. He'll be leaving his house in a little while and heading for the club. Do what you have to do. You know, if there's one thing I've learned, it's that we must obey the rules of the game. We can pick the game, Nico Belik, but we cannot change the rules. See you later. Thank you. 
Ну чего? Привет, принцесса. You got a problem? Niko. Niko Belik. You and Dimitri are taking over, no? This is not about taking over. You brought this on yourself. You pushed things too far. You would be dead if it wasn't for me. That is what Dimitri wanted when you killed Vlad. Dimitri... My brother. You see this? This statue says we are brothers for life. And now he betrays me. You didn't give him a choice. <laughs> you should have been calm. No one, not Dimitri, not anyone tells me to come. You think Dimitri would have survived prison without me? He'd just be some prison queen had I not been there. Meet for some gin monkey! I am not dead yet. Some are still loyal to me. Guards! I'm going to fight you! You fight like a worm, like spine of worm, bad You are nothing, Barry. You are weak. You are the strong survivor. I want to have some baka! People! Help me! This is your last party, man! I'm coming for you! Oh, you think this hurts? Fuck you! I can take out this no. motherfucker right now! Take cover, brother! You lying! want to die. Faustin is dead. You did a good thing, a hard thing, but a good thing. Hopefully this will mean peace with Petrovic. <laughs> 